So the Spartan says to the Roman, when the chips are down, the buffalo is empty. Get it? The buffalo is empty? I think you need to work on another ending for that story. Aw, oh, come on. It wasn't that bad. An old friend of mine, Cirrus, lives in the next village. I'm gonna stop for a minute and say hello to him since we're here. I'll be right back. Gabrielle, you go ahead. I'll catch up to you in a few minutes. Okay. When the chips are down, the cow is empty. Maybe I should have used the Minotaur. Hmm. Something's not right here. Not so tough. Cirrus, what's going on? Zena, my friend, barbarians are destroying our village, and they're looking for ah. Uh... Cirrus, someone is going to regret this.
mother ever tell you not to play with matches? Who sent you here? King Valerian repaid us to distract you while his soldiers kidnap your friend on the road. They took her to his castle on the island of Kronos. This King Valerian better have a big army.
Well, Xena, looks like you're not doing so well. You failed your friends, made a long trip to this crummy place, and you still have no idea what you're up against. Ares? If you have anything to do with this, I swear I'll... The question is, if you try to fail and succeed, which have you done? You'll have to start trying a little harder, unless you want to succeed at failure. I have more important things to do than listen to riddles. <laughs>
Games. Where is Gabrielle? She has been chosen for a very special ceremony. Her sacrifice will help establish a new world order. Yeah. But time is short and I must go to ensure her delivery. You can run, but you can't hide.
Gabrielle? Why is trouble always breathing down your neck? It was all I could do to keep that thing from breathing on me at all. But I did hear him plotting with some renegade Amazons. Something about evil magic, human sacrifice, and a new world order? I've heard there's an Amazon village nearby. Let's pay them a visit.
Sacrifice to bring on the new world order, your friend will stand in for me quite nicely. sorcery and soon to be leader of the new world order which will replace the gods you may think you are powerful because you've broken some of my allies but they were weak and I don't need them now that I've got your friend Gabrielle her sacrifice on my altar will allow me to become more powerful than Zeus himself <laughs> over my dead body 
so be it. Hmm. <laughs> 
up and smell the sulfur. As much as I'd like to, I can't help you here. You'll have to throw yourself at the mercy of Hades to get out of this place. Great. But how do I get there from here? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Hades, I need your help. Calibrax has great powers that will be used for evil unless you can send me to the surface world. Hmm. Her magic abilities continue to increase. Well, the gods don't need her kind of competition. As a favor, I'll send you to the village of Turnip. There you can find the Lyre of Orpheus. Use it as the key to her undoing. Medical followers of Calibrax are patrolling the streets. These druids have captured our village seer, and they are holding him prisoner while they search for our only treasure. The liar of Orpheus will be yours if you can rescue our beloved one. I'll do what I can. Use extreme caution. If they detect you, they will kill you. Ah! <laughs> 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 
You should have known that smoking can kill you. <coughs> Thank you, Zina. It, it has, has been, been predicted that the liar of Orpheus can unlock the gates of destiny. For those who seek to destroy evil, it is foretold that this evil will be found in the Temple of Pentacles. You must go now.
Ares, just what's your involvement with Calibrax and her cult? I have no interest in them, except that this Calibrax is getting on my nerves. If you need it, I'll help you get rid of her. Since you have the lyre, you can use it to open the gate. You are too late, Sina. My powers are complete. All that remains is the death of you and your friend. Destroy her! Calibrax, I think your magic act just di disappeared.
Gabrielle? Sina! It's about time you got here. Are you all right? Oh, I'm fine. Just fine. If you don't count being held captive in this stinking place, listening to that bimbo rant all day about taking over the world. They gave me nothing to eat, nothing to drink, and the smell of those black vipers would make a barbarian sick. Speaking of food, I'm hungry. Hmm. Sacred black vipers. I hear these things taste like chicken. Hmm. Not bad. If you can get around the smell. Now that's disgusting. Oh well, it looks like I now have the difficult job of writing an interesting story about all of this. Seems like I had to do all the dirty work saving your life. Okay, how about if next time you get kidnapped, you get dragged off to some creepy temple, and you get tied to an altar by snakes waiting for a snack? Speaking of food, I'm still hungry. Got any more of that viper jerky? If we both eat it, the smell won't bother you. Wouldn't it be great if I could find a way to tell a story that would totally immerse people? You know, like they were experiencing it for real. Slaying dragons and fighting evil, like they were actually doing it. Sort of like it was a game or something. Yeah, a game. Now that would be fun. <laughs>